G'day folks, I'm Rob and I review stuff. So today we are on day number 8. It is December 8th, which means we are up to beer number 8. It's supposed to be that way around maybe. Looks like an 8 either way. Beer number 8 of the beer advent calendar going through to December 25, Christmas Day. So, let's open up this bad boy and see what... We have in store today. Haven't had a dark beer yet with the advent calendar. Maybe this one might be it. What do we got? All right. Today we have a Holgate ESB Extra Special Bitter. Now I have had this beer before on a few occasions. Actually, I've had it on tap, and it is one of the first beers that actually got me into craft beer. The old Holgate ESB. This is something that's pretty near and dear to my heart. I've had it on a few occasions before, but let's crack it open, get it in the glass, and see what is what. We'll just give you the critical stats here. It is 5% alcohol by volume. Holgate Brew House. I have actually visited the brewery. It's really quite nice up in the mountains there in a wood end near Mount Macedon. So we have English crystal and roast malts, an abundance of East Kent Golding hops, finished with a touch of Aussie Galaxy hops as well. So, a really nice beer, this one from memory. Let's get it in the glass. Bit of smoke today coming out of the, the bottle. Extra special bitter and a bit of an English style beer, this one, and off white head, it's about one finger there, and it's like a dark golden colour, I'd call that. Slightly opaque and that carbonation is just rushing right up through that glass there. So it looks like quite a fizzy one. Let's get it down the hatch. Cheers, folks. Mm. Really rich, roasty, malty flavour on this one. Little touch of bitterness. It's not very bitter. It's a very smooth drinking beer. Just a bit, a touch of bitterness on the end quickly dissipates. It's got a very sweet, nutty aroma to it as well. Yeah, like a sort of like a roasted chestnut, sort of giving off the aroma. Mm. But this is a really nice beer. And actually, when I had it on tap, it's a hand pump beer. So it's in that English tradition where. You don't really have it cold. It's sort of more of a, a room temperature style of beer. Very typical traditional English ale, this one. And as the bottle says, a touch of Galaxy hops in there as well. Just chuck in some Galaxy, why not? Very smooth. It is quite high on the carbonation though. So um, maybe I'd prefer it if it was just slightly less carbonated. Sort of more in that English tradition as well with the hand pump. But still, a very nice, easy drinking beer. It's got a, a good body to it. Nice sort of slightly crisp, slightly bitter finish. Not overly bitter as the name would suggest. Just slightly, but it's got a very nutty, roasted, oh, excuse me, there's that carbonation kicking in. But um, yeah, very like a roasted chestnut kind of a taste to it. Mm. That is a really nice beer. Just as good as I remember it. 
So if you ever find yourselves near Mount Macedon or Woodend, check out the Holgate Brewery. Got some nice food there as well. And that is their ESB Extra Special Bitter. 40 IBUs on this one, so about mid-range on the bitterness scale there. But a very nice beer, so that'll um, wrap it up for today's beer. Beer number 8 from the Beer Advent Calendar from Booze Bud. So again, if you want to check that out, just Google Booze Bud, and it's a really good way to get yourselves into craft beer. You'll try a bunch of different styles in this Advent Calendar, and there's also ones that you can pick up from Dan Murphy's as well. It's around about the same price where you get yourself a different beer for 25 days. So yeah, again, great gift idea for anyone that loves beer. And um, a great way to sort of try some different craft beer from different breweries, different styles that you would never think of picking up yourself. And you never know, you might find something that you really, really like that you wouldn't have otherwise got. So yep, that'll wrap it up today. So um, we'll be back tomorrow with beer number nine. Cheers.